Hydrogen trains were supposed to be the clean future of rail. But in 2025, the company behind the first hydrogen train just hit pause. Alstom has stopped new hydrogen train development after funding dried up and the numbers stopped making sense. Real-world pilots in Germany and elsewhere ran into fuel supply issues, high cost and reliability problems, while batteries and simple overhead lines keep getting cheaper and easier to operate. At the same time, battery trains can now run up to 80 to 120 kilometers between electrified sections, which is enough to cover remaining diesel routes in Europe. That's why Europe is quietly shifting to an electrification plus battery strategy, and hydrogen rail is being pushed into small niche instead of mainstream. Countries like India, China, and the US and others are still testing hydrogen trains. But the global pattern is clear. Wherever you can run wires or batteries, hydrogen struggles to compete. Thanks for watching. If this video gave a new angle on hydrogen trains, hit like, drop a comment with your thoughts, and subscribe to Search Pulse for more sharp takes on rail and infrastructure.